He thinks he can get them through the cage. Alright, well, I'm going to tell you how I have my cricket thing set up and stuff. Well, it can have four tubes, but I took two tubes out so then they would have more room and I could get crickets easier. And for food and stuff, I have two food dishes and two water dishes so then they have, like, they don't ever run out. So then they're not always getting crowded whenever they're trying to drink. I don't know what he thinks he's going to do. I wonder what would happen if I put him inside there. There would be a massacre. I don't want him running back there. But, uh, pretty soon I'm gonna have, like, a 66 quart bin. So then I can get as many crickets as I want. But, uh, yeah, the setup I did, it's pretty nice. Like, there's two water dishes and two food dishes. And I had 100 crickets, but I have, like, 50 now because I fed a bunch of them to them. Because I have to feed them like 10 a day, so. Okay, I'll get one out and show you how he eats them. Hang on, I'm going to set my camera down real quick. All right, so I called him a cricket. I have small crickets. I don't know. Uh, they're not pinheads, that's all I know. So, what I do is get it here. I'll see if he'll eat it from my hand. Oh, yep, he got it. But, uh, pretty soon, because I'm doing camping soon, um, I'm gonna have a 10 gallon tank and. Um, I'm gonna put a baby bearded dragon in with him. He's only a year old, and some of you are gonna say, "Oh, you can't do that." But yeah, he he doesn't. He's not an aggressive thing. I put I put a um a a, a salamander, <coughs> a green no a green anole with him, and he didn't do anything. So I'm gonna be able to put a baby in with him, and if he don't like it, then I'm just going to put it in a 10-gallon tank, which I'll travel, and I'll be buying a critter cre cre critter keeper for him, so, uh, <clears throat> in about two months, I'll have a baby bearded dragon, hopefully, I'll get a video of it, they're really nice, they're at Petco, but they're really expensive, they're $59.99, they suck, but they are really nice. Uh, that's Cairo. Cages up there. Oh, yeah, I forgot to show you. I got a new light fixture. It's the UVB for him. And then I have my heat lamp. That gives him some light and stuff. I don't really even have to have that light on. I just do it for heat. Because the temp gauge needs to stay at, like, 90. So, uh... Yeah, I, I just have to run that all day and then turn it off at night. I don't have to have a heat lamp or anything, but I still do it. So then, 
whenever I do turn it off, it don't do anything. I'm going to close my door real quick. And then whenever... And then whenever I need to change the sand, I go like a whole big bag of desert blend. The reason why I took out one of the tubes is because one of them got a crack in it, and I don't want crickets running all through the house. Um, that's pretty much it for this video. Um, I'll have a video up of me uh having a baby. I will probably get a stand right here or over there somewhere. But I'm gonna be moving up to my other room that I had a fire in. And I this is not this is just a temporary room for now. Um I'm gonna I need to stop teasing him, he's gonna get upset. But um yeah, I will be moving into my other room, in my old room soon. So then... Wow, I just dropped all my lights. Well, um, I will... Hang on, I gotta set my camera down so then I can put that up and then I'm gonna show you my room. show you my old room that, um, uh, that I had a fire in. I'm repainting all of it. I'm making it useful. Yeah. Why? Because I was showing them my cricket cage and stuff. And I have my 29 gallon fish tank. I'm going to have a new carpet and everything. I'm getting a queen size bed. It's going to be awesome. So, um, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, please, uh, comment on this. Tell me if it's good or not. Uh, so, and subscribe. Subscribe for this little guy.
but um yeah once I uh, get my new room it'll be nice and I'll uh, I'll get another video up soon. I'm gonna post this right now, so thanks.